Brother, I can hear screams of a woman from this direction. I'm from his house. I think she's about to give birth. Brother, let's help her. We have to help her. Me, I can't kill a woman in that state. Our oh, God forbid. You fool! Are you out of your mind? Do you know who us? Do you even know how important this job is to us? Then we have to kill her. If we don't kill her, kill instead! Oh. Then pretend you killed her. Who are you? And what are you doing here? I'm just a passerby. I overheard your conversation. My wisdom told me that woman must be saved. Please, oh. let's save her. Oh. Brother, let's go and save her. We just have to help her. Okay, fine. But do you know how dangerous this is? We might get caught. Then keep it a secret. You tell no one. I if you are with Congresswoman is a baby girl. Omohono. Omoho. She's such a beautiful girl. Thank you. Thank God. My name is Imotinya. My name is Usasu. Usasu, man. Give this to her. They help me turn the old man outside. Why are you talking like this? Mm. Mm. You will take care of her yourself. Osasu, grow up and be a great person. What is the matter? What of her mother? She is dead. Dead? She died after giving birth to her. Oh, 
How is it? Is the job done? It has been done perfectly. You can have your leave. Thank you. Let's go. Do you think you both are going to live with this kind of job? <laughs> you just signed your death. Papa, who was the baby? A fossa. She is your younger sister. I may have a younger sister just like my friends. Yes, you just have one. Do you promise to take good care of her? Yes, Papa. I have a younger sister. I'm happy. Good. I don't know how you managed to become a palace guard. You spend nearly three hours in getting ready. Don't you know you need to be quick and smart? Usasu, are you the one saying this? You, you that can spend three whole years getting ready for a one hour occasion. Oh, it is my fault waiting for you all this while. Won't you wait for me? I'm sorry. I'm sorry now. Do you think I can even stay angry at you? You are really doing a great job for me. You have tried a lot. Thank you, Your Highness. Life belongs to you, and I owe you, Your Highness. Ita, Ita Po. I must take my leave, Your Highness. Ita. My brother, can't you see the business is not the same again? What is happening now? All the profits we make, we pay them as tax to the palace. Ah, ah. Is that my problem? Yeah. See, I have vested 100 to bars of yam yesterday. Yeah. I even lied to the palace, it was 35. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Brother. Hey. We must go to the palace. Okay. Oh, hey, oh. Sir, 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 sir. Sir, what is it? He might just committed suicide. He hung himself. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Yes. We, we, we are sure, we are sure. We are sure. Huh? Huh? Lead us to the place. Okay, Please. Sir. This way. Let's go, let's go. This way. Let's go. Please. Come, come. Hey. Oh. He is the head of Martians. Yes. Bring him down. Would he commit suicide? Let us take him away and inform the king about this. Take him! I do not like the way we conduct businesses with our neighboring towns. The competition is getting too much. Your Majesty, I would like to say this. Too many communities are involved in oil production. Hmm. Greetings, Your Majesty. The palace greets you. I am sorry for disturbing your meeting. The head of Marshall was found dead. Hmm? Huh? Dead? Yes, my king. He 
was found hanged on a tree near Ogba River. Why will he hang himself? I mean, why will he commit suicide? <clears throat> my king, my king, you can never say why he had committed suicide. Maybe, maybe he was a corrupt man. Oh, he has a problem with the family. What do you think you are saying? We all know the head of the merchant. Umogu, he was one of the most loyal subjects of this kingdom. <clears throat> Uh, I want to agree with what he just said. We all know the head of the uh, uh, merchant is a very loyal servant. Mogu, I, I suspect somebody must have threatened him. Uh, 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 your Highness, who wants to threaten anybody in this community? Who wants to threaten anyone in this community? Who wants the time? When everyone is struggling to see her, he, he or she can feed his family. Your Highness, he killed himself. What if this case is not suicide? Your Majesty, he just reported the man was found hanging on a tree. That is actually suicide. Forgive me for joining your conversation. I know someone who can help. She alone can tell if she was murdered or if I committed suicide. A she? Yes, my king. Uh, 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 your Majesty, are you saying you are bringing in a magician here to this kingdom? She is not a magician. Oh, who is she? She's a traditional medicine doctor. Then bring her to my palace. Yes, my Long live your majesty. Is this the local medical doctor? Yes, my king. Oh, she's quite young. What is your name, young lady? My name is Osasu, Your Majesty. Can you actually find the death of the head merchant? Yes, Your Majesty. How did you come about this? I learned it from my late father, Your oh. Majesty. Woman. I want you to conduct a thorough investigation the death of the head merchants. If it was suicide or if it was murdered. I will try my best within the next few days, Your Majesty. What's up, Mary? He said... A traditional medicine doctor? Yes, Your Highness. The king has instructed her to investigate the death of the head of the merchant. And who is she? She's a sister to one of the palace guards. Hmm. Interesting. I will do all my best to stop her. We don't have much time. You better act fast. Yes, Your Majesty. I must take my leave. Your Majesty, you summoned me. Bagbe. I have an assignment for you. If at all the head of Machen was murdered, I want you to look for who did it secretly. Your Majesty, me? Yes, or is there any other person here? Or wouldn't you be able to do it? Yes, Your Majesty. I will do it. I can do it. Good. 
You will be rewarded nicely if you do a good job. Okay, Your Majesty. Rachel. <laughs> you little rat! I know you just met with the king. So what did the both of you discuss? <laughs> you think I'm joking? I said what did the both of you discuss? I don't know what you're talking about. Tell me what the both of you discussed and save your life. So you still don't want to confess? You still don't want to tell me what you discussed with the king? I don't know what you're talking about. Congratulations. You just passed the test. <coughs> Your Majesty. You almost died. Well, you didn't anyway. <coughs> the plan still remains the same. But you have to be very careful. <sighs> Sakwe? Your Majesty. <coughs> Take that. Use it in, to treat yourself. Thank you, Your Majesty. Are you sure of what you are saying? Mm -hmm. The king, who sent you on a secret errand? Yes. Yeah. Sorry. But you think you can do this on your own? Seriously, I've been thinking about that. I will help you out. No, I don't want to put you in danger. Danger? Life itself is dangerous. And everything in it. I will help you out. Are you sure? What kind of poison is this? This poison must be very powerful poison. I need to find out what kind of poison is this. Have you looked into the girl? I'm still working on it. Still working on it? My queen, I'm investigating on her secretly. You have to hurry up. Okay, my queen. What about the farmers that bring maize and beans? I looked into the secret store yesterday. It's not improving. <sighs> my queen, the king has already noticed <laughs> that the storehouse is getting low. And he's doing his best to look who is behind it. Well, it's a good thing you slow down for the now. Let's look into other areas. But my greatest worry is the traditional medicine girl. <laughs> my queen, never to worry. Itapu, I'm on it. Why is I must take my leave. Who can be behind all this evil? Who is turning this kingdom upside down? Who can this be? Who? 
I will never forgive whoever is behind this. What is your report on the cause of death of the head merchant? Your Majesty, the head merchant did not commit suicide. His case is of murder. Murder? Yes, Your Majesty. But, but there is no sign of wound or anything on his body. Yes, Your Majesty. No sign of any injury on his body. Mm -hmm. Your Majesty, according to my findings, the head merchant was poisoned. Now, how did you know that he was poisoned? How did you know? Noble chiefs, his side stomach was swollen. His eyes were yellow, along with his legs. That is how poison reacts on someone, Your Majesty. Mm. Hmm. Wow, that's incredible. I'm impressed. So tell us, what type of poison was he given? Your Majesty, the poison is not from this town. It is a powerful poison. Mm. Woman, work on that. I want to know the poison that was used to kill him. As you please, Your Majesty. About a poison. He said. What are your steps? That girl is trying hard on us. Noble Chief, I'm really trying my best on it. No, 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 no. You are not trying your best. Your best is not good enough. You tell your best is not good enough. Do you know? Do you know that the king has found and cause of the head of merchants? Do you know? Now listen. Listen. I will not go down alone. So if you know what is good for you, step up your game. Is that clear? Noble chief, I will try my best. I must take my leave. It used to be my very, very loyal subject. I just hope he has not been bought over. But if he does, I and my we not go down alone. <laughs> what? You mean the king is aware that he was poisoned? Yes, your highness. Chief Amadi informed me about that. What about your findings on the girl? Oh yes, my queen. I have some information on her. And what about? Her highness, her name is Osasu. She lives near the market square where she performs her autopsy. Good one. Trust it up. I'm always in charge. Oh, Sasu. <laughs> Your Highness, I must take my leave. Oh, Sasu. Oh, Sasu. <laughs> I like me. Who is that? Oh, Sasu. Oh, you? Identify yourself now! I came to warn you. The death of head of merchant is none of your business. Just stop everything. Who are you to tell me to stop? Just tell them you made a mistake. It was suicide. Why are your teeth so sharp? I'm almost bleeding. That serves you right. 
The king summons you immediately. Let's go. You mean they told you to stop the investigation? Yes, your majesty. Who do you think is behind this? I can't say, your majesty. I couldn't see his face. But I almost saw it. But don't you think it's dangerous for a lady to be chasing a man at night? What if he was not alone? What if there were many? My brother taught me how to defend myself, your majesty. Efosa did? Yes, your majesty. Because I used to get myself into trouble when I was young. Go away! I will not go away. If you don't go away, I will beat you. Come and beat me. Stop! Why are you beating him? Is it because he's powerless? Is it your cousin? If you don't go away, I will beat you. Come and beat me now. Osasu! Osasu! Did you get into trouble again? I found some boys bullying their friend. I went to help him and they beat me too. If father sees you like this, he will beat you even more. Brother, can you help me? With what? Teach me how to defend myself. <laughs> how? Yes, I know you are good in it. Because your dream is to become a palace guide. <sighs> but you are a lady. Please. Okay, I will teach you. Usasu the warrior. Wow, your childhood was funny. Mrs. Defendant. <laughs> Thank you, Your Majesty. Um, should I send some guards to your house? No, no, Your Majesty. I am fine. Okay. But I always caught you home. Who knows? They might still be hanging out there waiting for you. It is an honor, Your Majesty. Let's go. He told her and she refused? Yes. She even chased him. She chased him? Yes, Your Highness. She chased him. Hmm. I can see she's really dragging herself to her grave. Your Highness, Chief Amani asked me to tell you to visit the king tonight. Why? Hmm. He said the king is filled with worries. You alone can relieve him from some pain. Why does he care about the king? Is there something he needs? Your Highness, I don't know. Perhaps. And why would you follow such a dangerous person? I am sorry, brother. I just wanted to see his face. That is all. What if you get in danger? I will not get into danger. Trust me. Acting too brave can cause you trouble, you know. Why is he angry at me? Brother. 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 I am sorry. Why will you be sorry? I will not try it next time. You know all I care about is you. 
You have to be careful with the way you do things. So, will you come in now? No, I'm... Um... Then stay out. Stubborn girl. What a brave lady. Just like a boy. She reminds me of someone. I can see you're in a great mood. My queen, I didn't call for you. I came on my own because I've missed you. My lord, I can see you're not in a good mood. I came to relieve you of your pains tonight. Mm. <laughs> I came to flex those succulent royal muscles of yours. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Come here, my queen. <laughs> <laughs> Please, you sell it a good death. I don't sell them. Please, Lao. Please. Who are you? I am a traditional medicine doctor. This is a very expensive poison. It is not from this town. That is why it is very expensive. How many people have you sold this to? That is none of your business. How does it work? Add a little to water. Mix it with any food. The effects are yellow eyes and feet. Loss of news. Swollen stomach. But no blood. Thank you very much. Thank you. D don't worry. Take, take it easy with me. We will boost up supply soon. Please, be patient with me. Wait. Wait. You. Wait. Hey, hey, hey. 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 Please. I'm leaving again. We can't afford to lose our customers. That means we're losing money. Ita, go and inform Chief Amadi quickly. Please. Yes, Your Highness. No, no, no they can't live like that. I, 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 I can't afford to lose money. Any news? Your Majesty, it is time to bury the dead man. Are you done with the cops? Yes, Your Majesty. So what kind of poison was given to him? I'm still on it. I haven't been able to find that out yet. You haven't been able to I'm find that? Madi, don't rush her. Let her take her time. Thank you, Your Majesty. You can go. Baba, talk way. He said. Ita, tell the queen that the king is fully supporting the girl. And if care is not taken, we all will be exposed. And that will be suicidal. 
Noble chief, I will. Relax. I'm working on it. I do, I do not want to hear that word that you're working on it. I want you to be on top of it. We all are involved in this. Noble chief, I will do my best. I will resolve positive results. I must take a leave. I have to meet with her myself. Your Highness. I can't stay back here doing nothing. Your Highness. Don't you think you might risk exposing us? I'll be very careful to avoid suspicion. Your Highness, I suggest you don't. It's a bad idea. Ita, I want to see her eyeball to eyeball. <clears throat> okay, Your Highness. Who are you? Show some respect to the Queen. Your Highness, I want you to put an end to the investigation of the head of Marchant. What? I should stop the investigation? You can hear her clearly. Y Your Highness, but it's the King's order. I know. Just tell him something else. He committed suicide, not murder. Why? Are you trying to question her highness? I can't do it, your highness. You can't do what? I can't do it. I'm only trying to save you from destroying yourself. I am sorry, your highness. But I beg to take my leave now. What? The Queen herself? Yes. She asked me to stop my investigation on head merchants. That means she's behind the man's death. I also think so. The truth is coming out gradually. This is getting very, very interesting. Mm -hmm. Could what they're saying be true? How could she have done that? No. I don't believe this. Majesty, I did not kill him. Shut your mouth. You poisoned him. No. I did not. Bring the woman in.
Did you buy poison from this woman? Your Majesty, I Yes or no? Yes, Your Majesty. Ah! I don't know. God, take these women and put them in different cells. If you let me speak with Majesty, please, just for a few seconds. If you don't keep your mouth shut, I will shut it for you. Mother! Look at her! Oh, you think you can escape because you are pretty? Huh, young maiden, if you don't keep shut your mouth, we'll help you do the shutting. Now move! Right now! Move! Inside! Please! Please! I need to speak to you! Look at them! See. Good for nothing lot! Shut up your mouth! I told you I'm innocent! Get me out of here! You Why will an old woman like me steal a common jar of oil? Wicked people. That is your business. Look you at them. Not there. Wicked people. My worries are over. <laughs> you have nothing to worry about anymore, Your Highness. <sighs> Still thinking. I don't know what to do to her brother. Your Highness. Should we kill him? I still don't know. But I think killing him will be the best. Let's kill him. Not so fast. He might be useful later. If you say so, Your Highness. <laughs> I must take my leave. I have some important issues to attend to. Your Majesty, what will not happen to the issue on the ground? Since it has already been proven that the head merchant was murdered. Your Majesty, according to our culture, whoever kills must himself be killed. That is it, Your Majesty. She is supposed to be killed. I understand how you will feel. But the case on ground is very critical. No one should be killed without proper evidence. Mm -hmm. I would like for further investigation to be carried out first. Uh, but your, your Majesty, if there's no other thing to talk about, this meeting is adjourned. Fellow chiefs, um, um, my fellow chiefs, I do not understand what is going on anymore. It is said that the gay has been rendered guilty. So why don't we just give judgment so that the case will be clear? She has to go in for it mm. because the hand that slapped the sword will pay with its blood. Exactly. Mm. Exactly. My queen, what is the matter? Your Majesty, what do you think you're doing? You know the law and culture of this kingdom, that whoever kills shall be killed. Why are you delaying justice on matter that is resolved? My queen, your Majesty. what is your interest in this child's death? You just asked me that question? Yes, and I need answers. <laughs> you really want to know, right? I want to know. As a queen of this kingdom, it is my duty to ensure that justice is not averted. It is also my duty to point out loopholes to the king in areas he omits them. <laughs> I see. Loopholes, eh? Mm. 
Your eyes are very beautiful, my daughter. Thank you, Mama. You have this resemblance to someone I knew several years ago. Oh. Really? What was her name again? Yes. Her name was Mwetinya. Mwetinya was her name. Father, you have never told me anything about my mother. Hmm. Osasu, do you really want to know? Yes, Father. She was really a beautiful woman. With a big brown eyes like that of an owl. It's so bad I didn't get to know more about her. She died after giving birth to you. Her name is Imwetinya. Imwetinya Osa. Imwetinya Osa. Yes. She was a palace maid, the king's favorite. Rumor has it that she was sleeping with the king and she got pregnant. Does the king have interest in that girl? No, it can't be. That girl is too young for him. It's not possible. No, no, never. Ita, you're my closest confidence. And I trust you so much. I want you to deliver this to the Queen. Tell her it's a remuneration from the oil trade with the Eurobas. Noble Chief, I don't think she's in a great mood for business issues. Why? What's wrong with her? Queen and the king had some confrontation. Confrontation? Yes, noble chief. Confrontation. I see. It's okay, you can go. Confrontation. What sort of confrontation? I hope the king has not found out anything. Sakwe? Yes, your majesty. I haven't seen a Fosa since the day Osasu was sent to prison. I have also noticed that too, your majesty. Go look for him. And tell him to see me. About up eh? So, what happened after she got pregnant? She went missing. Till today, nobody knows her whereabouts. Nobody knows? Are you by chance a daughter? No. I think they are just namesakes. My mother wasn't a maid. You look so much like her. So much like her. But okay. You still can't find him? No, Your Majesty. I can't find him. Something is not right. Something must have happened to him. Your Majesty, should I look into it? No, wait. I will have to meet with Osasu first. About to pay.
Where are you taking me to? Move, move, move. Where are you taking me to? Move. The king wants to have a word with you. His Majesty? Yes. Move! 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 Your Majesty. Poor child. I know you might have suffered a lot. I am okay, Your Majesty. I know you have a better plan. The conversation we had the other day still bothers me. I keep thinking about it. Your Majesty, this is the poison that was used to kill the man. Are you sure? Yes, Your Majesty. I confirmed it. I found out everything about it. And who is behind it? Your Majesty. From the look on your face, it's obvious you know who is behind it. I am sorry, Your Majesty. I am not sh sure yet of who is behind it, but... But what? Just tell me! Her Royal Highness. Huh? The Queen. My Queen? Why would you even mention her name here? She came to me the other day, Your Majesty, threatening that I stop the investigation. She did what? Your Majesty, I know you might find it difficult to believe, but, but do order my brother to investigate on it. Your brother? I was about asking of him. What do you mean, Your Majesty? Have you not seen him? No, I haven't. Do you think something might have happened to him? Ita, how is the other trade going? Fine, Your Highness. Are you sure we're making profit? Yes, Your Highness. Good profit? Yes, Your Highness. But what should we do to Efosa? Mm, Efosa. Is he of use to us? He's not, Your Highness. Then why keep him? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Okay, Your Highness. No room for liability. Osakwe, your majesty, get some guards and organize a search party for Enforcer immediately. Yes, your majesty. It shall be done. Is my queen truly behind this? What will she gain? What are you doing here by this time? It is none of your business. You better leave. Do you know who I am? Who are you? I want to know who you are. I am the deputy head of guards. Guards! Seize them! What? 
they have been captured? Yes, Your Highness. The King's Guard captured them. We are in trouble. There must be a way to resolve this. My Queen, you just have to calm down. Itapo is on his game. Go, go. Go, go call Chief Amadi immediately. Okay, Your Highness. Your Majesty, uh, well, what uh, what about the the murder case? Because uh, I am thinking that uh, that uh, yes, Your Majesty, I am thinking that uh, that matter should should be treated uh, immediately, Your Majesty. He said uh, what he has said is very true. Because Your Majesty. The people are saying so many things about it. I'm making an idea of Your Majesty, we want you to tell us the reason why you're still delaying this girl's case, Your Majesty. <laughs> As a responsible ruler of the people, it is impossible for me to pass judgment without investigating. I think that girl is innocent. And for those hoodlums who attempted to kill one of my guards, I want to know who is behind it. And I'm doing it myself. And your majesty, you're doing it yourself. Yes. Is there a crime in it? No, 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 there's no crime in it. So be it. And so be it. What? He's investigating himself? Yes, Your Highness. That is what the noble chief told me. That might land us in trouble. Make arrangements. I want to see him. Okay, Your Highness. Have they confessed? Uh, no, Your Majesty. You people better confess now. And if you do, you will be highly rewarded. So tell me, who sent you? Your, Your Highness, no one sent us. We are saying the truth. Are you ah! How dare you lie to the king? Oh. Oh. I repeat. You will be rewarded if you speak the truth. Who sent you? No, no one sent us. That's... Your Majesty. Continue to torture them until they speak. Your Excellency, there is fire on the mountain. I know what is going on. And I'm working on it. I have sent a message to the hoodlums already. That's good. Listen, no matter the suffer, no matter the torture or what they go through, they must not spill a word. <laughs> I trust you. <laughs> Listen, you have nothing to fear, okay? I am behind you. Nothing will happen to you. <laughs> chief, chief. Chief, chief. Amadi. I trust you always. Amadi. I, I beg to take my leave now. <laughs> we own this kingdom. I trust you. <laughs> I will see more of you. They don't know why they call me Chief Amadi. Oh. Oh, they will see the other side of me. <laughs> Thank you. 
Osasu. Osasu, are you alright in here? Brother. Yes, brother. I am fine. Look at you. Pain all over your face. I am fine. What I should be more worried about is you. No. No, I'm fine, brother. Do you know how worried I have been? I know. And that's why I'm here for you. I can see the hoodlums have refused to confess. But I know, very soon the truth will be out. Uh, Your Majesty, I would like to join the investigation, if, uh, if you would allow me. Thank you, Chief Amadi. I know how concerned you are, but sorry. I have to decline your offer. Uh -huh. uh, well, uh, your, your Majesty, I do understand. I do understand. And as for Osasu, I will pronounce a judgment tomorrow. Umogwa Tokbe! He's My daughter, tomorrow is your judgment day. I pray God well. I will miss you. Thank you, Mama. I will miss you too. I enjoyed your stories, particularly the one about Imwetinyan. I told you that story because you look like her. Thank you, Mama. My beloved people, as a king of this kingdom, I have every right and duty to do what is right and to follow the laws of the land. I summon you all here today to witness the case at hand. Bring in the prisoners. These are the two prisoners. This woman right here, she is a traditional medicine doctor. And she's the one to find out if the head of the merchant was murdered or committed suicide. And I'm here to ask her directly. I am ready to answer any of your questions, Your Majesty. Good. Good. Everyone, listen carefully. Woman, was the head of merchant murdered or committed suicide? Your Majesty, head merchant did not commit suicide. He was killed. Hey! And how did you know that? I am a traditional medicine doctor. I have studied a lot of illness and their symptoms. I learned all from my late father, who was also a local doctor. They lost what killed him? Did you know? He was poisoned. Hey. And how did you find out about that? His eyes were yellow. His stomach was swollen. His feet were yellow as well. These are signs of poison, Your Majesty. Hey, people are heartless. Indeed, my sister. Can you imagine what a calamity? Huh? And you, woman? Yes, Your Majesty. Did you sell poison to this lady? 
Yes. She bought poison from me. Osasu, mm. did you buy poison from her? Yes, Your Majesty. To, hey, hey. to, to find out more about the death of the head missions, Your Majesty. And did you find anything? I am still on it, Your Majesty. Hmm. Now to you, poison seller. Who else did you sell poison to? Your Majesty. Can you be Your Majesty. There? Speak! This man also bought the poison from me. God, excuse me. I want to speak with a woman. Woman, I need your attention. It seems you are doing well in prison. But I want you to do something for me. And what would that be? I want you to mention my name during the trial tomorrow. Please, I want you to cover up for the queen. Mention my name. You and your family will be highly rewarded. Did you say Ita? Yes, Your Majesty. <laughs> he bought it before the death of the head merchant. Is it true that you bought poison from her? Yes, Your Majesty. I'm sorry. Eh? Who sent you? No one, Your Majesty. Then why? He's the reason behind my mother's death. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is my judgment. This woman, Osasu, will be set free. Ita will be sent to jail. And you, the present seller, you will be sent to jail for two years. I have mercy, Your Majesty. Mercy. Your case is still pending. Greetings, Your Majesty. I have something to show you, my Majesty. Where did you get this from? Your Majesty, is there something about this bit? That bill is from Musasu's mother. What? My mother? And what is her name? Umwetia, Your Majesty. What? Did you just say Umwetia? Just Your Majesty. How about that little witch? Have you gotten rid of her? Yes, Your Highness. We have. You have no worries anymore. Good. She should go and give birth to a child in heaven. I'm waiting here. The king's favorite. <laughs> what about the people you sent? They have also been killed, your highness. Good. Very good. What is going on? What is really happening? Where did you get it? My father, who happens to be an adopted father, told me about it. Efosa. Yes, Papa. I want you to keep this a secret. A secret? Yes. Okay, Papa. Osasu is a princess. A princess? Yes. How? I helped a mother when she was about to be killed. She told the woman who helped her give birth everything about her. She was the king's favorite maid. 
aquí. I don't know what to say. My people. This is enough evidence. My daughter is alive. She's my child. Opa! Topa! My child is alive. Everything I have labored for is ruined. Even in debt, this maiden still troubles me. Oh, Sasu, it won't be easy for the both of us in this palace. All I have labored for is ruined. It's a pity you are not alive today. Our daughter is a great child. Your daughter is gifted. I thought I would be a king without a child. Hmm. Why didn't you tell me? Why did you hide this from me? I'm sorry. I had to. It was for your own safety. Why? Why did you hide this from me? Why didn't you tell me the king is my father? I am sorry. Sorry. I have decided to bring my daughter into the palace. Hmm. <laughs> ah, my king, your daughter. She's most welcome. Oba la tope! Isa! Your Majesty, what brings you here at this time of the night? Is it a crime to come visit my queen? No, my lord. I, I, I wasn't just expecting you. My queen. I know it's my fault. I know what this has cost to our marriage. No, it's not your fault. I didn't know the gods would not bless me with a child. We have a lot to discuss tonight. I'm sorry about the child. No, you don't need to. I understand. I understand how much you loved Imoetinya. I understand you have an obligation towards her child. My queen, all I ask is for you to take Osasu as your own. I will. I wish I have a child of my own. I wish I have a baby like she did. Why would I? I would take her as my child. Thank you very much, my queen. Thank you. You don't need to thank me.
You are afar off. Come closer. Hmm? Come a little closer. Your Majesty. No one will dare disturb us. I promise you that. The stars will always rise and come for men to see. The same way my love is to you. Kings have come and more kings will come. But the love that I have for you will never change. Do you even have any idea how much I love you? Your Majesty, I, I know you love me, but I'm afraid of your wife, the Queen. I have said this times and times again. She is just the Queen and not my Lord. It is you that my heart longs for. It will not change. Emotinya, please understand. Okay, Your Majesty. Um, Your Majesty, there's, there's, there's something I want to discuss with you. What is it again? Anytime you give me that smile, good tidings are on my doorstep. What is it? Talk to me. Emotinya, should I beseech the gods of our land before you speak? Hmm? Your Majesty, I'm pregnant. You're pregnant! Oh, Sawese! Finally, I will become a father. Your Majesty, don't, don't you like it? No, I do not like it. I love it. This is the best news I have received all my life. The gods be praised. I will make sure of something. Nobody in this land would ever disrespect you. Even the queen. You will even replace her. I love you more than anything. Thank you, Your Majesty. Thank you. Your Majesty! Your Majesty, what's happening? Muetinha, this is not the best time and place to talk about this. You have to leave the village immediately. When it is time, I would officially make you my wife. Your Majesty! Your Majesty, where am I supposed to go? Do not worry. My God is in front. He will take you somewhere safe. He owes me a debt. <laughs> and I trust he will not break it. Your Majesty, Majesty, you have to go. Your Majesty. Please. Will you come and visit me? More than anything, I will come. I will visit you as often as I can. But please, take this. <laughs> take this. Guard it, please. Majesty. You have to go. Protect my child. My tion, protect my child. Are you okay, my princess daughter? Yes, your majesty. Is there anything you need? No, your majesty. <laughs> Call me father. No, father. Good. As for the old woman you requested to be released, she has been set free. Thank you, Father. <laughs> Ita, how are you? Your Highness, I know I will be here tomorrow. But I want you to do something for me. What is that? Don't plead on my behalf when you meet the king. Or feel bad. I own you my life. It's a debt I must pay, which is right. I remember when I first met you as a kid. Highness, 
Your Highness, please help me. I have nowhere to go. I have no mother, no father. Please help me. I can't do anything. Please. I can't even deliver a secret message safely. Are you sure? I'm very sure, Your Highness. I'm very sure. Please. Your Highness, please. Okay. Come with me. Ah, thank you, Your Highness. Thank you. Thank you. Life, they say, does not always give you what you want. It has come to my notice that there has been a decline in the trading activities in our kingdom. The monopolistic market must end. I have decided to appoint a new head of the merchants to regulate the system. Your Majesty, a new head of Martians? Yes. Well, 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 well that is nice. <laughs> that is good. It's nice. Uh, but Your Majesty, do you have somebody in mind? If not, I can suggest someone. Chief, perfectly Chief well. Amadi, I have already made my choice. It's just a suggestion. It's just a suggestion. It's just a, it's just a suggestion. Mm -hmm. The new head of the merchants shall be and will be My beautiful princess, Princess Usasuhe. <laughs> My boy, man. Oba, talk me. He said. Oba, talk me. He said. How are you? I am fine, Your Highness. Ever since you became the head of merchants, I can see you're doing very well. Thank you, Your Highness. By the way, I learned you mounted several guards by the Ogba River. Don't you think you're scaring possible traders away? No, Your Highness. Genuine traders wouldn't take that path. It is off limits. If you say so, just be careful on how you carry out your affairs. Thank you, Your Highness. I can see you are uh, going to see His Majesty. It's all right, you'll see him. I'll see him later. Princess daughter. I am fine, father. Is there anything you want? Father, I want to ask for your permission. You go ahead. I want to look into my mother's death. My adopted father once mentioned that on the day I was being born, some persons were trying to murder her. Mm. And you want to look into it? Yes, father. 
you have my permission. Thank you, Father. Tell Chief Amadi to put an hold to all the supplies going through the Ogba boundary. Yes, Your Highness. I called you both here because of the oil scarcity. Our kingdom used to be very good in oil production. Your Majesty, everything has a season. But due to seasonal changes, we didn't get enough rain this year. But I can assure you that the upcoming year we will have bumper harvest, Your Majesty. What do you have to say, my princess daughter? Your Majesty, concerning the all scarcity, I have done some findings. It has come to my notice that more than 50% of all produced in this kingdom is being smuggled out. Huh? What? Something like this is happening in my kingdom? Yes, Father. I am working on who they are and who they are trading with. Thank you, my princess daughter. You have done a great work. Who are you? Are you the head of the guards? Yes, and what? I heard you are very close to the princess. Huh? Uh, so? I still can't recognize you. I was among those who were sent to kill the princess, mother, many years ago. What? And what are you doing here? I am here so that you can help me to take revenge on those who did this to me. I know you still don't understand, but I'll break it down bit by bit. Many years ago, my brother and I we were sent to kill the princess' mother. But along the line, an Unba saw us and stopped us. But we didn't kill her because she was about to give birth. And after the job, the same person sent some men after us to kill my brother and I. I managed to escape. But my brother, my brother was born to death. I am sorry for your loss, but I still don't believe you. What? Do you think I'm lying? Look at my face. See this face? This is an evidence that I'm not lying. Now who sent you? It will surprise you that the person who sent us lives within the palace. What did you just say? Yes. The queen. 
The Queen sent us. The Queen sent you? Yes. She did. And after that, she sent some men after us to kill us to make sure we won't expose her. You see this car? This car. I have been living with this for many years. And this is what I want from you. I want you to help me to get revenge on the Queen. I want you to do everything within your power. I mean everything within your power to get revenge on the Queen. We we'll meet again sometime. Someday. And why will her highness do this? Is it because she's jealous? Or what? What a wicked word. We supplied 15 gallons of oil and only pay for 30. Where is the 20 balance? Ah, hey, oh, oh, no, no, yeah. <laughs> hey, no, 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 I do not understand your language. Speak English. Hey, I, I, don't, I don't have paid. I've paid it all. I don't, I'm not indebted. Hey, listen to me. Don't play with me. I'm saying it. Don't play with me. I've paid. I've paid it all. Who are this bunch of lifeless guard? Ephosa. Ephosa, you have the infantry to bring this lifeless guards to me. To my boat. Princess Usazo sent us. Who is she? I am Chief Amadi. You bring this lifeless guards to my boat to arrest me. Tie him up and move him to the palace! Don't you dare come close to me. Shoot for Madi! Move or I'll move you! No move! I said move! Chief Amadi has been arrested? Yes, Your Highness. Oh, I am doomed. All I have labored for is gone. Oh, the gods are angry with me. You mean Chief Amadi is involved in this? Yes, Father. Same person I thought that was very loyal to me. Why can't I trust anyone in this palace anymore? Father, all hope is not lost. <sighs> Chief Amadi, this is the betrayal of the highest order. Now that Chief Ahmadin has been stripped and banished from this kingdom, another will take his position. Ah! I wish Chief Iki was here. This good news from our great king would have glad in his heart. Umo Gwanta Be! He said! There is something else I would like to share with you, my noble chiefs. The queen, the queen of this kingdom is behind the death of our princess's mother. 
she has admitted to it. So I hereby denounce a stripper of a position as the queen of my kingdom. Osakwe, your majesty. Efosa, your majesty. Oh, bad talk, man! Yes, sir! No man you take a number of one. A new book, no book on the way. Oh, God, the book I'm with that way. Oh, go on, panel in way. A quap on the law. No man you take a number of one. Who are Tom Mose? Who to Thomas Zaka? Who your bell would do gay? Oh, bad talk, man! Yes, sir! So all these years, I've been living with such a terrible woman.